Hiding here between the, the fever few here and the curry plant is um, common comfrey, some phytum of fish now. And um, comfrey leaf is an amazing plant really. It was called bone set in the olden days because of its ability to um, heal broken bones. And in fact, the Latin name comfrey comes from confrera, which means to knit together. So it's particularly good as a poultice for broken bones, um, sprained tendons. When I was a child, my aunt used to, if we sprained an ankle or something, my aunt used to take the leaves off. Um, they grow quite a bit bigger than this and pound them up and then bandage them directly onto our ankle to help. Um, there's a lot of controversy about taking comfrey internally these days and a lot of people when they see it as an ingredient and in things get a little bit worried and that's because comfrey contains alkaloids. Now some Phytum officinal, which is the English comfrey, um, is actually a lot safer. Um, it doesn't contain the emetine used in Russian comfrey, which has the purple flowers. Um, but these days it tends to only be used externally. And it's a particularly good herb to use cosmetically because it contains allantoin, which helps with skin cell renewal and skin cell regeneration and to bind the whole connective tissue together. So um, the humble bone set here is um, one of the final ingredients in our Venatone leg cream and there because it really helps with all that connective tissue.